Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're talking about Robert Whitaker versus Hamzat Chemayev. Robert Whitaker, 26 wins, 7 losses. He's 3-2 in his last 5 fights. Plus 185 underdog at 33 years old. 6 foot tall with a 73 and a half inch reach. Fighting Hamzat Chemayev, 13-0, minus 225 favorite. 30 years old, fighting basically at home. 6-2 with a 75 inch reach. In a re one and a half inch reach advantage for Hamzat with the two inch height advantage as well. Minus 225 is a little generous, I think, personally. Last win was a majority decision against Kamaru Usman. And then Kevin Holland, where he fate touched, glove, uh, glove touched him because he's a bitch, you know. Um, he's also a fucking baby. I'm sorry. I, I, I'm, I'm so tired of Hamzat Chemaev. Every goddamn excuse he has, he doesn't fight. He's so hyped, he can barely, he can't even make the weight that he should be fighting at. I'm so done with Hamzat Chemayev. I'm done with the hype. I'm done. I'm not saying he's not a good fighter because, of, yes, he's a good fighter. I'm not critiquing that. But every big opportunity, every big fight, like Paul Acosta, Chemayev would be awesome. And he, he gets sick. Oh, I'm so sick. I may never fight again. Oh, I'm in the hospital now. I may never fight again. Oh, ho, oh, oh, ho, oh. ho, ho. Dude, excuse after excuse after excuse. Do I think this is a good matchup for Hamza? Yes, I do. I, I do think so. I think Whitaker can cause a lot of problems for Hamza, especially if it goes past that first round. He has good takedown defense. His grappling is, is very good. He's very strong. He has awkward angles where he throws from, like, knocking out Chemayev's um, last opponent, or opponent, um, Aliskarov. Um, again, I like Whitaker a lot. I, I think his striking do a lot of good stuff. At home, it's going to be very hard to beat Chemayev, I think, and he still has the grappling. I'm going to I'm take, and also him being a favorite of minus 225 is wild to me, to be honest, because... Whitaker's been way more active. He's fought twice in a year and a half, or three times in a year and a half. Um, and Hamza Chemayev has fought three times in over two and a half years. Not good. It's once a year. Not good. I'm going Whitaker. I think he beats up Chemayev as the fight goes on. And hopefully we get to see Hamza Chemayev laying face down, ass up, and done. I don't know. Come up with another excuse. Oh, I was sick, but I had to fight. Oh, blah, blah, blah. Oh, blah, 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 blah. Hopefully he has dude wipes on his ass this time. If you get the reference, you're a true G. As always, guys, subscribe, like, comment. Let me know who you're picking. Peace.